How's it hanging? My name is Olatize and today I'm going to be showing you how to build a dumbbell interchange. So let's get on with it. So to start off with, you want to extend your highway entrance right out. Then you want to find your centre point and start a road 4 units from it going 20 units each way. Then off the centre point of both of those roads, have a road coming back 20 units. Then we're going to delete all the highway back, just leaving the end bits. Up next we need to lower the ground at the centre point by 15 ground units or so. And then we want to flatten this out so it's all the same level. and tidy up all the edges if you need to. Now you want to use the slope tool to get some nice smooth ground for our highways, but don't set the centre point as the end point, have it just over from it either side. Now you should have something that looks like this. Now for the next part we need to get some water in here. You can use either a fresh water outlet, an eco sewage outlet or a standard sewage outlet. But if you're using one of the sewage outlets then uh, be aware that you need to have a city to get sewage from. So now that that's filled up we want to get some keys as close as we can to the roads going along it. You want to go from the center out to make sure that you get the exact same cost every single time. Now we want to delete these roads around it, leaving these end bits so we know where our center point is. We can now also delete our water tower and fresh water outlet. Now we want to place down a water pump and a sewage outlet to clear all this water out. Now that's all cleared out, we can delete the water pump and the turbine. And now it's time to put in our highways again. Now we have this nice dip in our highway with retaining walls. It's now time to build our bridge going over this. We want our elevation step at lowest settings and to raise it six times from our centre point. Then extend the bridge over 12 units each side, bringing it back down to ground level. And this is how your bridge should look. Right, we want to extend our bridge roads out by 5 units, then coming off that we're going to build a 5x5 five five roundabout. Then you want to make a cross in this roundabout and delete the road extension coming off the bridge. Now with standard roads create little ramps going on and off the bridge. And then do the same over the other side. Now we're going to get a little 3x3 three three curve coming off the roundabout and then create a 10x10 10 10 curve going down towards the highway. Then using a straight road you want to connect this to the highway. Remember the cost of the connection as you will be using this on all four sides. Now between these two nodes you want a straight road coming off. This will adjust the road making a sharper connection to the roundabout. Then repeat this on the other side of the roundabout. Now you can delete the cross from the centre of the roundabout, upgrade all the roads and flip them all around so they're facing the right way.
Now you want to repeat all of that on the opposite side of the interchange. If you are enjoying the video so far, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe. And finally, you want to upgrade the bridge to a two-way, four-lane highway. And you should be left with something that looks exactly like this. And now it's time to decorate it. And there we have it, our dumbbell interchange. If you did enjoy the video, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya!